My name is Marcia Walters and I'm the grandmother of Miles Blackson. And he's been swimming here at the Lenny Kreiselberg Swim Academy since 1st of November of 2008. I didn't learn to swim until I was an adult, until Miles' mother was maybe 16. And so we wanted something better, something for Miles. We wanted him to swim because African-American children die or they drown at the rate of three times the other children and so we wanted him to know how to swim. We felt that was our commitment to him, to his life and to the legacy of him. And so he's learned that and so safety is the most important thing. Miles has had numerous survival tests and he's when he doesn't have a swim trunks on, he knows, he senses that he's going to have a survival test. And he doesn't particularly like the survival test. So he knew that he was going to have this test. And so that was why he cried. But as soon as he hit the water and he turned on his back, which is the Lenny Kreiselberg technique, that you swim on your back for safety, he was okay. And so safety is the most important thing safety, um, health and fitness, um, because we want him to be strong and healthy and we feel and believe that it grows and develops his immune system. And I think lastly, the, the fun. He, he loves the water, he's grown to love it. He didn't always love it. In the beginning he cried for like two months and then he just stopped because he grew to love the water and he liked swimming. The, the, the chance of drowning is too great. And so we have made a commitment to, for him to be an Olympic swimmer. <laughs> so that's our commitment to Miles and to the Lenny Kreiselberg School to have the first African-American gold medal swimmer.